With candidates from all across the country, the Nigeria Customs Service began the process by assessing credentials, health conditions, necessary documentation, amongst others. The candidates on the first day came from 12 states within the country. We met with some of them to gauge their experience on day one. Let's give credit to Nigerian Customs Service over here in Gowalada. The hospitality they showed us upon our arrival, even with the weather, the weather wasn't friendly. They made sure that we were sheltered in order not to be destroyed by rain. So they attended to us perfectly and it was a very nice one. Um, from the process, when I got to the gate, how they conducted everything, it has been so swift. The officers are very nice and I noticed they, all, they, they showed the way to applicants who we're not so sure about where to go and they've handled everything very well. The second day was a bit more physical. The candidates were required to run around the premises to assess their physical potential. The candidates, after the grueling exercise, expressed their experience. It's my first time of uh, doing this kind of thing. So I really enjoyed it. I took a three kilometer jogging and walk. It was it was a bit exhausting, but I was able to cover the lap within the 25 minutes specified for the females and 20 minutes specified for the men. So um, it was very successful and I look forward to coming back and joining the service. The process is still ongoing and the candidates shortlisted from all states in Nigeria are optimistic they will be eligible to officially be part of the Nigeria Customs Service. Abdul Karim Zermi, NCBN. Abuja.